Hello all, and welcome to Skull That Works. If you're um, returning, I welcome you back. If you're new here, my name is Blake, and I am a tackle harpist, or tell harpist, from North Alabama. And I have given a series of lessons on how to play this instrument right here. Now, today I have planned to um, give you a um, lesson on uh, how to play Harin Gris by Donheim. So, I'm going to try my best to... Um, to uh, teach you how to play play this song, like a song and cover song, and I will also would like to advise that I am neither an expert or a authority of this instrument, or a, or even even at most a master of the instrument at all. So I'm just here just to teach you how to play this um, this song and and help you um, you um, learn something from here. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to first give you the tuning right now. Which is I am tuned to a D sharp. Now, for three string tackle harpists like myself, this will be a D sharp three on the on the low end. The middle string will be at A sharp three, and then your um your outer string closest to your hand, the one that you'll be playing on, is going to be a D sharp four. Now, this can also transcribe to also four string tackle harpists, which is similar to this. The, the only difference that will be the same will be the D sharp three, A sharp three, D sharp four. And then you have another string on the outside closer to your hand, which would be the the another A sharp three. The only difference would be is you're still playing on the uh, D sharp four. So basically, as I have right here, on my thing. If you ignore the these um, top numbers here, because these are these are irrelevant. It'll be this string will be an A sharp three, and this will be A sharp three, but this will be the one you'll be playing on, which is in blue right here. That one will be an A or not A, but D sharp four. The rest, the rest will be soon just similar to the tackle harp, three string tackle harp as well. So, and what happens is I'll show you again. This the blue is your melody string, and these two will have like a twin droning effect. So you only have a little bit more depth into that as you play. So. As we go along, I am going to bring the camera a little bit closer to this to let you, well, you know what, never mind. I was going to bring it closer, and I decided not to because um, I think we can see it from here just fine. So what we're going to do is we're going to teach you how to play Hurrying Grass. Now, Hurrying Grass is um, pretty, a sim pretty much simple, a simple song. The, the thing is, this is not, this version is not absolute. Um, version of this because most but it gives you the most um the tackle most of the tackle harper parts in general is what it's going to give you because a lot of it's a, a bunch of other um drums and stuff in the background so um this will only give you where you can just follow it and that's the reason why we're in this tuning as well because it's the tuning that is the um key that is used a lot um that it will go it goes along with on the actual recording that um, Donham actually uses. So we're gonna start with um, it's gonna be a bit, just like a bunch of drones, kind of like just straight drones, just to get you to get it started, you know. And then we go. That's that one and two and. Basically, long and short, short. And also, it's easy to start with a with a down bow. That's that's a down bow. That's an up bow. If you're thinking about it. down bow, is pulling towards is a pulling motion, and then um, a short a um a um up bow is a pushing motion. So basically, when you're pushing, it's up bow. When you're um, pulling, it's a down bow. So it's down and short, short, down and short, short. And I just filmed the camera. <laughs> okay. Um, now we're going here. Now what we're going to do is that's not uh, that's just the Boeing technique we're going to be using a little bit here. And it's a little, but um, what we're going to be going is so. That that um last part of that will be you'll be hitting the um 
you're, you're using your first finger and hitting like a half step from the um, from the intuning peg here. That note right there, which would be your first finger right here. You can see this finger right there or close to it. But you're, you're also droning at the same time with the other string. And it's got that slur I was telling you about in the previous video. So it's... Down, down, and long. And that, that quick long is a, is a slur. Basically, um, that's, again, that's a slur there. Now we're going to go back into our. Now we're going to do this again with our second finger here, right close to your first finger, which is another half step. Then stroke up. So. That's uh, up on the um, up bow will be again up bow on that on that second finger. not a slur by the way so you got a two finger this finger here <laughs> now I'm using the um, the um, the back finger instead of my um, usual technique or you can also use the back finger like that it's kind of a little tricky though <laughs> you can use the back of the fingers as well like that it, it works um, in that same position, but now we're going to our next part. So as you go, it will be a down bow, I believe. Right here. Basically, when that when you go back, it goes back to the first, your first finger, on that on that first on that on that string right there, in that same position. So, so basically, that to that. That's all you gotta do. So it's. Don't squeal at first like I just did. Again, don't forget that first slur when you start that phrase. That's basically the first phrase of the song. That starts off, and then when you go to the second phrase, which is uh, if I remember 
it. <laughs> So what that is, um, going um, after you learn your first phrase, which was, we're gonna go on our second phrase, which is. So it's so be set um, your second finger close to here. So it's, so it's second. Second open, so. so it's second open, then third finger right here, close to your second finger, because it's like a sharp. Actually, it's a little bit more further, sorry. It's about that far from your second finger. So your second finger will be here, this will be here, about here. So you have to search for that make sure it's right but that's basically how we did how i learned it yeah it's right there right there close to your um fourth so so it's literally Back to your second. So it's one and two. Oh no, no. Three and oh, three. Second one. And then it's a slur from a slur from your second finger to your first. first phrase oh I forgot when you go when you go that first phrase it's then you draw again so you down do a down bow and then it's a and then it's a slur from second to first on the on that on that starting that first phrase so it's down bow, then slur up, open, set third, second, first, then a slur from um, a slur from the second to the first, then open. That's your, that's the main first verse of the song. And then you will fill that out with a bit. Of, you'll fill out out with a bunch of drums. Something like that. I mean, it'd be like some drums. Like... about in the, in, that, in, the, in the last video be. a little bit of those drums you can do that uh, I, I would count to about two of those maybe let's try let's try it. Two of those will happen, and then what you'll do is on the um, second one is the it's about a third of that of that of that first phrase. So it's, 
It's that same that same sort as, as when you start it. Then, you, then it's second, first, open. So it says. So it's first, second, first, open. Okay. Yeah, so it's the same, it's like the same as a first when you do that little one and two, kind of like that one and. Basically, basically that one. Bowing basically is that one and two and three and four, I believe. So, but on that first one, it's us on that one and the, then that's the one and and then a slur to the first on the on the on two. Just like just like the beginning of the song. So it's so together it's like this. that sequence over again because it just repeats itself for a few times and then it, re it does so it's again it's so it's shaking for some reason but so it's so if you if you get that um just practice that and you can you know you can make it um a little bit um better uh then you can get play along with the um album and that's how it, you can tell how many times you do it each time now if you're doing the cover if you're just doing the cover of the song then I wouldn't worry about all the filler that was in there, all the fi the filler notes where there's where the tackle harp is not playing. Just just play to it and just so you can even add a little bit drone sometimes. <laughs> pretty much the whole song and um um that's pretty much i mean again that's pretty much the whole song to <laughs> do it sorry sorry but um again go, i'll just practice that and you should be able to um easily tackle tackle the rest of the song as much as possible so again we'll go over the song here <coughs> sorry
that helps you out. Um, if you um, like this video, um, please like and subscribe to the channel. Um, don't forget to um, check out my um, my other social media. I'll, um, I'll put those below in the comment or in the description, and leave a comment. And I hope to see you on the next video. Skull.